There's a place called Farmer's Luck, the place where I grew up. There's a In the previous episode, we anchored up just outside a military base and we met up with some friends who were going to join us all the way down to Lisbon. We had a beautiful sail going down from Sao Jacinto to Nazaré and as soon as we had tied up the boat, we left to discover the beautiful city famous for its huge waves. But first, we just had to stop and say hi to the owner and maker of this really odd looking boat in the marina. Unfortunately, he barely spoke any English, so we couldn't ask all those questions that popped up in our minds. In 2011, the Guinness Book of World Records recognized the biggest wave ever surfed. It was 23.8 meters and surfed by Garrett McNamara. But there have been reports of even bigger waves being surfed. The most recent one in January 2018, a local guy named Hugo Wow reportedly surfed a 35 meter wave. We took a quick hop down to Peniche, and just as we arrived in the harbor, a trimaran... Around over here on the rocks, uh, so therefore the captain of the marina has not been... Uh, we have not been able to reach him all day! <laughs> yes, Krina, it was very difficult to reach the marina officer. Luckily no one was hurt and the trimaran was just a bit scratched up. So today we're installing a new foot pump for our fresh water so that the tank that is connected to the water maker is connected to a foot pump so that way we'll always have some fresh water hopefully and we won't use as much fresh water uh -huh. should be good and we'll have some redundancy so if the electric pump breaks then we'll have still have a foot pump to connect everything nice very nice very very nice it's working!
we had so much fun hanging out with friends from back home and exploring the Portuguese coast together. So a lot of the times we even forgot to bring out the camera. After Peniche we did a day sail down to Cascais where unfortunately Sebastian and Karina had to pack their bags and leave us. But before they left we just managed to squeeze in some extra boat work. So Sebastian helped me get up to the top of the mast so we could do a rig inspection before crossing over to Madeira. So yeah, I'm nice. Very cool. Hello. Okay, I'll wait on. That's about to get all right. So, better now. It's always such a weird feeling driving into a big city like this really feels like an accomplishment to have gone all the way here on your own boat. It's, it's a really cool feeling. This is the second capital we're going into. The last one was Amsterdam, so it was quite a while ago. And you have all these boats, all these buildings, all these people. It's gonna be nice. watching and I hope you liked the episode. In the next one we will meet up with my mother and sister and together we will explore the beautiful city of Lisbon. We will also start prepping the boat for our four day crossing over to Madeira and Porto Santo. So hope to see you then and if you liked the episode don't forget to like, share and subscribe.